podcast, weather from where you live. Our high today near 50 degrees, the official high 48. We will be much warmer than that. In fact, tomorrow's high 35 degrees above average. Normal high is around 35. We are going to be around 60. It looks like for tomorrow afternoon. So temperatures are warming up overnight. In fact, we've got a pretty docile night right now across the greater Lafayette area. However, the rain, even a couple rumbles of thunder is possible and it is on the way for overnight. You can see 45 degrees, mostly cloudy skies at the Purdue airport. So the rain hasn't moved in there yet. Relative humidity is at 71% and those winds are picking up out of the east southeast at 17 miles an hour. So we will begin to see those winds shift come out of the southeast and that's really going to warm us up as a warm front works its way through overnight. And that's why we will have our temperatures rising into the 50s overnight. So it's going to be a warm start to your Monday and we are looking at the dividing line here. Take a look some heavy snow back through Minneapolis, Wisconsin. They've got snow, but with us warmer temperatures to the south that is spilling northward. That's going to keep us with the rain and you can see we do have some pockets here of yellow and red that's tracking off to the east northeast. So again, we could have maybe a couple thunderstorms around the area and nothing severe, uh, but this is what we're looking like by 7 a.m. We could have a few leftover rain showers, but the bulk of it will be overnight while we're sleeping. 53 though for 7 a.m. already and you can see we will have some drying out cloudy skies by noon, maybe a few peaks of sunshine late in the day. Temperatures again around 60 degrees, very warm for this time of the year. So it looks like we're going to stay with those warmer conditions at least for a couple more days and then we'll begin to see that cool down getting back to normal. Overnight lows, we're going to see these continue to rise 48 degrees this hour, 49 for Crawfordsville. So so that is pretty, pretty mild when our average high is 35. So a little unusual. Once again, we'll have those temperatures warming up overnight. So then tomorrow afternoon, very spring like 61. It looks like uh, for much of the area, we will be around that 60 degree mark. So uh, if you can get outside and enjoy it, do do that. We should be dry by the afternoon. You can see for Monday morning, we will have some scattered showers. The winds will be coming out of the southwest now, and that's going to be warming us up. Hopefully by 10 o'clock, much of the rain will be out of the area, staying mostly cloudy. Looks like maybe a few peaks of sunshine. The big story, in fact, this is just updated, showing us now in the blue. So we could have a little bit of some snow and a wintry mix. We'll have to wait and see on that. But this is showing Tuesday around noontime. Our next system is going to move through, and that's where we could see some heavier rain showers throughout the day. And we will have to look out for the possibility of some flooding in some of those low lying areas. But this again will be moving out by Tuesday afternoon and behind that some calm, quiet conditions, especially as we get into New Year's Eve. I think it's going to be quiet, but New Year's Day we could have maybe a wintry mix with some snow rain around the area. We'll have to wait and see on that as well. Uh, rainfall amounts for this first batch of rain. It looks like by tomorrow afternoon we're going to have a little bit of a wide range here, but right around a half inch will be the most it looks like for areas north of Lafayette Monticello, but we are looking at uh, a good amount of rainfall, but especially for Tuesday, we'll have to kind of stay weather aware as we do have some heavy rain expected across the area. Here's a look then for your seven day forecast for tomorrow. Very spring like enjoy 60 and it will be dry for much of the day. Watch out for some patchy fog in the morning until noontime. And then Tuesday is still pretty good. It will be rainy though with the heavy rain, 50 degrees. When clearing out 40, same for Thursday, New Year's Eve. Looks like we'll have some partly cloudy skies. Chance for some rain late uh, overnight and then into our Saturday. Maybe a little bit of a wintry mix with temperatures slowly getting back to normal.